Hi everyone, in this video today we will learn to create exposure transition also known as camera flash transition in Filmora. Let's do it. So after opening Filmora, I have already imported three stock videos here. I will select all of them by holding the shift key and then I will drag and drop them onto the timeline. I will be adding the exposure transition at two points between these three video clips. So let's see how we can do this. I'll go to the adjustment layer and I will select this preset one. I will drag and drop it onto the timeline above our video layers. Let's zoom in to have a better view of what we are doing. I have placed this adjustment layer in a way that it covers the meeting point of my first two clips. Now I will double click on this adjustment layer. Here I will go to the color panel and here I will scroll down to find the color option. Here. Now I will drag my playhead to the point where these two clips are meeting. Now I will be adding a keyframe for the color panel here. Then I will increase the values of color panel to 100. I will increase them for exposure, brightness and contrast to 100. Now I will scroll down to the light panel. Here also I will add a keyframe and then I will increase all the sliders to 100. Highlight, shadow, white and black. Let's make all of them 100. Now I will move the playhead a couple of frames back to a point where I want my transition to begin. There I will reset the values of these two panels both light panel and color panel I will reset their values to original that is to 0. Now I will move the playhead to a couple of frames ahead like this. I will bring this to a point where I want my transition to end. There also I will reset the values of both color and light panel to 0. Then click on OK. So our exposure transition has been applied between the first two clips. Let's see how this looks. So this is how this looks. Now we will just copy this adjustment layer. Right click. Copy. And then we will click on the second video layer and then we will right click and paste this. Now we will zoom out first and then we will drag this adjustment layer towards the left so that it perfectly covers the meeting point of second and third clip. Now right click and go to edit properties for this adjustment layer and make sure that your second keyframe coincides with the meeting point of the clips. Click on OK. And now this transition effect has been applied to the second and third clip as well. Let's preview how this looks in our final video. So firstly you will observe this between the first and second clip and then you will see the same transition between the second and third clip. So that's it for this video. I hope you find this video useful. If yes, please give it a like, share your views in the comment section and please subscribe to the channel Cinematic Edit. Thank you so much.